Hi, hello. I actually did not plan on doing a reading today, but I felt really, really, really guided to do this one right now. And it is called Will I Get My Justice or something like that. Um, first of all, I want to point out that justice for me, it's not like is person XYZ that did anything to me going to be punished. This is not a petty channel. It's not about being petty. It's not about hoping or wishing ill on somebody else. Okay, it's not about that. If you were looking for this kind of reading, wishing ill on somebody else, then I'm not your reader. This is not your reading. It is more about something like redemption. Will I get the justice I seek? Will I be hurt? Will my truth be hurt? Um, something more going into that direction, okay? It is going to be a yes or no. Pick a card. And I'm going to use other cards as well. The Power Animal cards, the Psychic Tarot, and the Wisdom of the Rhythm Realms. This one I will have to read. And um, we are going to use... This deck, it does contain nudity on some cards, so please be aware. Yes, um, first of all, I would like to say something about justice. Um, not, not really about justice, but it is going to be a yes or no, pick a card. Meaning that the answer can be a no. But, remember there is no... There's not one future, there's different timelines, okay? And all I can do is read whatever um, timeline you are on right now. Meaning, if you are in low frequency, it is most likely that your answer will not be a good one. But then do not fret, because you can always change the future by raising your frequency. And I think this is one of the reasons... I feel guided to do this video right now because it's very important to me that everybody out there knows that if you are facing some kind of injustice, do your shadow work. Listen to, I, I like Abraham Hicks for example on YouTube, I keep seeing it over and over, but there are others as well. Whomever you like that talks about law of attraction, manifestation does not matter whom you choose. It just has to be someone that you feel is right. Somebody who you feel gets you. And I'm going to prepare while I'm talking. <sighs> yeah. I'm doing this for a reason right now, obviously. But anyway, if this reading is something that you won't like make sure you change your future and you can change your future if you do um, inform yourself about law of attraction for example okay and this is very very important so if there is a no I'm not saying that there's going to be a no but we're going to have three piles so it is likable that likely that one of them may have a no or maybe even two. Let's not hope it. But this is just a timeline you're on right now, okay? If you drastically change your vibration and you do your work, you can change whatever outcome. Even if it's a yes, if you then do something that um, will take you down in some way. You can change a positive outcome into a negative one, okay? Let's not hope for that. But this is very important for me that you do understand, okay? Look, we do have the fulfillment of wishes. Just had to mention it. <laughs> so, my darlings. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. Do your shadow work. Do your manifestations. If you think negative, you will only draw in more and more and more negative stuff, okay? It's like the universe is always giving you what you're focusing on. If you focus on lack, if you focus on 
injustice, for example, this is not fair, this is not fair, this is not fair, universe will always give you exactly that, what you think is not fair, because you're putting your focus too much on what you don't want, or what you don't want is the situation where you feel it is not fair, right? So it's uh, more important to put your attention to what do I want, what would be fair, I want to be redeemed, what would it feel like to get there? This one. But I do hope you all get your yeses, meaning you're on the right track. And you don't have to do that much more work, right? This is basically all this is. Are you on the right track to get your justice? Or do you need to adjust anything? Whatever answer it's going to be, it's not going to be finalized, okay? So, before we start, first, okay, okay, this one wanted to come out. <laughs> I need to check if there, because those are some of very few decks I do um, read reversals, because you can tell in the book that um, they have a different meaning if they're an ally, if they're upright or a challenger, okay? So I'm going to check, is this... Right. No, I have to reverse this one. This one gets to stay. Okay. So. So these are your decks. Okay, we have deck one is the um, I see no evil. I hear no evil angel is number two. And I speak no evil. Number three, I chose those because...